In this video, I'm going to show you how to change the default port number on Pi-hole. I've been running Pi-hole now for over four years on my home network and tried to change the port number several times with no luck. As one side one update, it revert back to the default port number. But I decided last week that there was a way of doing it and to let it stick at the end of May 2023. And this is how I did it. Default, the default port number for port Pi hole is port 80, but I wanted to change it to port 8000. This port 80 on my network for me to set up my reverse proxy. Let's go. Firstly, we need to log into the Ubuntu server. So, as you can see here, I have a login prompt here to log into my Ubuntu. So, if I login yeah so you can see I'm in Ubuntu and what we need to do is I'll just copy and paste the commands in yeah but here I have the sudo which is root login and the nano is just the editor that I'm using to edit the the config file in in Pi hole right so if in your case if you don't have the nano editor you can put whatever editor you have here with the same command and it should work so if I do this it will ask me to log in again so this give me the permission to write to the file and you can see this file is empty and basically all we need to put in into this file yeah is is this command which is server dot port yeah space double quotes and then equal and then the port that you want to use yeah and then we do I do control X then yes to save hit enter and it takes me out of that file so you can see this external config file yeah when you run an update on Pi hole it will look into this file and any command in this file it will actually keep and write to the original file yeah um the original file is stored in if we if we do a cd and we go to here which is the light ftp folder you'll see what i'm talking about yeah if i do list to list the files you can see we got the config file for light tpd and also the external external one which is what this is the original file that pihole works from but any configuration in this file it keeps when it do the update All right so if i now restart pihole yeah as i've changed now to a thousand yeah um and then if i do pi hole here and then just say restart dns yeah to restart the dns service on pi hole yeah we should we should be ready to roll yeah so if i go now to pi hole you can see i've already had port 8000 change in both the config file in both these files here which is which is the external and the light conf file i've actually changed the ports in those in that file already and you can see where uh, where if i go and show you here i'll go to t pd yeah i open up this file you can see in here down here i've set it here to be port 8000 yeah so if i exit this because we haven't made any changes to so this has already been done yeah and i've restarted the dns server because i've put made that change into into the external config file right so now if i open a pi hole which is here log into it you 
now we're going to test if if the changes have worked so you can see at the moment i'm running on port 8000 now if i if i do the update on pi hole which it shows me down here i have an update to do yeah update available yeah so i'm going to run this command now in 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 the command prompt to update my pi pi hole serve service and then come back and we'll see if this has changed so if I just do CD here to exit that and I paste that and do pi all up and let it do the update we'll wait you say an update available three updates which, which I showed you on the original uh, page before which is here it says one two three updates available so they're showing you the three updates are are, are 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 needed so it's carrying out the updates at the moment and as a default this would have normally put back my pi hole back to port 80 so now we're going to check once this is complete and we log back in refresh pi hole to see if it has changed yeah so let's see We're waiting, waiting. Well, surely, I mean, once I'm editing this video, I'll speed this up for you so you don't have to sit and watch this being updated. Right, so now this is done, yeah, and it's updated. All the new versions have been updated. So now, if I go back now to Pi Hole, yeah and refresh we'll see if my changes of, of stock or it's revert back to port 80 so let's do a refresh you can see the changes have stayed yeah and look it's all it's all been done yeah so you can see all the three the updates have taken place and my port number which is port 8000 have remained the same after the update as before it used to revert back to port 80 and then I would have no web page showing here I would have to delete the 8000 to go back to the normal report so yeah thanks for watching again I'm still new to this YouTube video production thing I hope you find this video useful if so please give it a big fat thumbs up if not please leave a comment below also please hit the subscribe button in order to be notified of my next video thank you Laters.